Greetings auto enthusiasts. Today, we are going to check out the new Panoramic Eye Cockpit that will debut on the 2024 Peugeot E3008. The E3008 is a compact and stylish electric SUV that will replace the current 3008 model and will feature a new platform, a new design, and a new interior. The E3008 will be based on Stellantis STLA medium platform, which is designed for electric vehicles and will also underpin other models from Peugeot, Citroën, Opel, and Fiat. The E3008 will offer a choice of three powertrains, including a dual-motor, four-wheel drive option that will be a first for Peugeot. It will also offer a range of up to 700 kilometers, 435 miles, on the WLTP cycle with the largest battery option. The E3008 will feature a sleek and modern exterior design that will draw inspiration from the Peugeot Inception concept that was revealed in 2021. It will have a coupe-like roofline, a large grille-less front fascia with LED headlights and a logo that lights up, and slim LED taillights connected by a light bar. The E3008 will also get a new graphite gray paint option and a black roof for a sporty contrast. The highlight of the E3008 will be the new panoramic eye cockpit that will embody Peugeot's metamorphosis. The panoramic eye cockpit will feature a curved 21-inch high-definition floating panoramic screen that will combine the heads-up display and the central touchscreen. The touchscreen will run on Peugeot's new Link Connect interface, which will support wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. The panoramic eye cockpit will also feature a new digital instrument cluster, ambient LED lighting, and a redesigned steering wheel. The interior will also get new seat patterns, a restyled shift lever, and eye toggles for quick access to various functions. The 2024 Peugeot E3008 is expected to make its official debut in September 2023 and arrive in Europe by the end of 2023 or early 2024. It will compete with other compact electric SUVs such as the Hyundai Kona Electric, the Kia e-Niro, and the Volkswagen ID4. Thank you for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more auto news and reviews. See you next time.